And all right, of course, we are playing Fatal Frame for everybody. The bit, one of the spookiest games we're probably gonna be playing on this channel for me, which was a September emo for all of you lovely people. Chat's gonna be having fun because they're gonna be trying to spook the hair, scoop the words, spook the heck out of me with all the sound alerts we've got going, including the new spooky I ones. how long it's been since my brother and I can to see things. Also, rip no subtitles, sorry. <laughs> rip no subtitles. Yeah, if it does get too loud, you guys, of course, let me know. We're going to get a little bit of backstory on this game, though I guess it does. It plays anyway. So, so sweet. instead of you guys having to, like, oh, uh-oh. Hang on. Hang on. Because I will say, we are doing a GameStop online. Oh, did it reset this? You son of a gun. Hang on. You reset all my controls, I think. You guys are going to have so much fun with the sound alerts, aren't you? Oh. Why? But he left a note that led me to this place. I felt as though something was calling me here. Okay, y'all get to watch the intro. I swear I pr I did this last night. Oh, 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 I know what the problem is. Freaking Steam. What is the problems? All right, for real, for real this time, we are starting Fatal Frame. You guys get to have fun with sound alerts, all that noise. Uh, yeah. Based on a true story, I think the lore was is that this really wasn't like a true story. It just made it more appealing for people in the U.S. and everything else. But uh, yeah, we've got through. We've got four nights. We gotta beat this. It takes what ten to fourteen hours or so. You guys are gonna get the sound alerts. You're not gonna. I don't think you guys are. No, they are on there. No, the sounds aren't on there. Okay, the sounds are coming through, but the little the little icons aren't. Okay. But alright. Let's get going. Or I kill the I wonder how long it's been. Or I kill the vibe my anyway. Brother and I began to see things other people can't see. Skimming Wikipedia aspects of the story are based on the creator's own spiritual experiences. Oh, my okay. big brother. He was so sweet and kind. He was the only one I could open up to about these visions. Hmm. After our mother died, he was my only family. Those some loud footsteps. This is Himuro Mansion. My brother was in search of someone. Junsei Takamine, a famous novelist. And a man my brother was very indebted to disappeared while researching a book. When he told me that he got a lead on Mr. Takamine's whereabouts, 
I am going to try to let the story speak for itself, of course. I felt uneasy, like he was going far away. I mean, I wouldn't want to go far away from here, wouldn't you? I don't care how badly you want to find somebody. Unless my loved one is missing in here somewhere. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. The only one I would go into this mansion for is likely spirit. Maybe some of my best friends. The forbidden rituals of this area. It looks like Mr. Takamine was doing research into them. I wonder if his group is still here. Mario! No. <laughs> uh... Mafuyu! That's more like it. A rattle, yolp. Alright, we got camera controls. Pull the camera, press the circle button. I'm gonna have to get used to this, because this has been a hot minute. Okay, circle to open up shooting mode. Photos with X or R1. Can move with L stick and right analog to move around. Okay. Alright, we all practice that. We all heckin' practice that. Okay, 180. I'm not gonna take a photo because we're gonna save film. We all save film. Alright. Easy enough though. She says without any threat whatsoever. It is an angry looking mask on the wall. What? You mean it's not a key item? <laughs> We're going to try to make this as lighthearted as possible because I know this is probably going to get a little draining for you guys and for me at some point, so. Humor is what makes the journey so smoother, am I right? All right, we'll go ahead and save. Yep. All right. I also learned out you can control his flashlight ever so slightly by moving the right analog stick. You move him with the left stick, you can move his flashlight with the right stick. Fun stuff. Yeah, like, this is meant to make you feel, like, alone. Like, this is meant to, like, creep you out. Like, this is why Fatal Frame has become such a staple. Oh. I see you. Rope hallway man. Okay. And y'all saw that little sensor there in the corner. Whenever that lights up, that means there's a photo opportunity, of course. Kind of glad these aren't snakes, but don't know why these are hanging in the hallway. Who's that handsome man? The big mirror, but it only shows my reflection. Where do you find extra film? Around. Literally. Uh. <laughs> it's like, why did it get so quiet? Uh, that's the worst thing in a horror movie or horror media of any kind is when the sound just cuts out, you know that something's coming and just it starts to build the tension. But I guess it's just like the sound effects or the soundtrack starting to, to loop. But it's just like, ugh. That dead silence is awful. I can't be the only one that thinks that. Like, it does such a good job of setting you up for a jump scare, which I will say warning. There's a reason this is down here, is that this is rated T for teen. Like, there's no language, there's no nudity, drinking, etc. But there is going to be, you know, violence. This is a game about ghosts and all their stories and whatnot. But um, there will also be jump scares, and I will likely scream, unfortunately. I mean... Depending on how loud and how close to this mic I screen, you guys might not even hear it. But you have been warned. You've been warned right now. Hey. <laughs> 
Because, yeah, this place is heckin' scoop, heckin' spoopy. Dust was stirred around the fireplace as if it's been used recently. I guess. I mean, if they were actually here. Samurai armor? Yes. Ultimate armor here. Doesn't seem just for show. Seen some hard use. Ooh. Yes. Yeah, just the sound design of this game is fantastic, too. This is why this series has become so popular in terms of horror games, especially the second one. Thank goodness you guys didn't make me play that, am I right? Ah! Hello. Ruth? There's always next year, true. Uh. Hey, well, that's a blue glow. Oh. Ah. Angry man. Oh, he angry. He very angry. Also, I did add another emote for you guys in chat. You now have a uh, Peepo Scared from uh, 7TV for just such occasions. It's seasonally appropriate. Yeah, we'll see if you guys get to make me play Fatal Frame 2 next year, which is like the pinnacle of scary games. Like, I'm not even kidding. Like, you look at a top 10 scary games a uh, list and I bet you Fatal Frame 2 is on there for good reasons I mean like not only is it like super scary but it also is like set up so well between like the story mechanics etc all that noise I got a rock yeah <laughs> appropriate appropriate usage but yeah I I vaguely remember that the first day that I played this years ago with Scherzo when we were teenagers. Um, other than that, I got no memory of it. <laughs> Just remember us starting to play it, being introduced to more horror games by him, of course. Because uh, little old me didn't do horror. I'm still very horror avoidant, but I'm a little older, maybe a little braver now. Maybe. But uh, there is one part, and maybe we'll see if my brain remembers it this notebook it's mr takamine's also again rip no rip no subtitles Can't be good. That was Mr. Takamine. So he did come here. Don't want any. I still wonder why you came here if it wasn't for your sister. If it was for some. Mm. Oh, hey. Ooh. Back off, I got a camera. I'm sure. I'm not sure I know how to use it. Okay, aim and shudder to attack ghosts. Inside the circle, power accumulates. Goes up as the more power accumulates in the camera. Play the ghost in your viewfinder, the circle glows. And the circle glows, take a shot. Kill the chemi damage, heavy damage when you take a shot during a shutter bug moment. We'll see how many of those I got. 
how many of those I get. I, I would say I'm a decent photographer, but... Back off. Ha ha! Nerd. Eat it! And that is how you take out ghosts in this game, and nothing else. That is all you have to defend yourself. With this camera. This camera has the power to expose things the normal eye can't see. I remember the incident from which I learned of its unique power to capture ghosts. Also, classic PS2 voice acting. <laughs> Bless them for laying the road for future voice acting and the careers above it and the quality. Grab this out and call the Winchesters, you won't. Like, I don't even know if salt would help us in this case. There's a padlock. Okay. This is a good little tutorial, though. Because while my Fuyu is very cool and handsome and nice to work with, he is not our protagonist! Hi. Well, that's a long way now. I guess I need to go the other way. Oh, wait. There's nothing in the chest of drawers. What about the box? I'm looking at the drawers. I want to look at the box. Dead gun it. Yeah, you know, chat. What would y'all say in your opinion? No, no judgment. What would you say in your opinion is the scariest game you've ever played? Like personally played, like not just watch played. Because putting yourselves in the shoes of playing the game is a lot different than watching it. Though watching it can also be scary. I will admit. I know the difference when I watch someone play a scary game before I go to bed. I know the difference of the feeling. But I mean, the one year we played Darkwood that was pretty dark and foreboding. Oh, that's 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 that thing. I thought I thought the little thing hanging over the fireplace was something in the background. Huh. The door to the entrance is open, but I'm sure it was just closed a while ago. Yeah. Wait, what, you're not gonna go through it? Oh, that was the door shutting. That was the door shutting. <laughs> So then, are we still following people? That's still closed, that's still closed. It's been two weeks since I last heard from my brother. And then he was gone. But he left a note that led me to this place. I felt as though something was calling me here. Hmm. The Strangling Ritual, Night One. Well, that's a first ta first chapter title. My brother was here. Uh, 
And now we're in the present, and now we've got color, and now we're introduced to our main character. <laughs> you guys are gonna try, aren't you? Alright, well now we got herbal medicine. Same angry looking mask. It's only been two weeks since our brother went missing. We have no idea what happened to him. Okay, we're gonna save again. Save early, save often, kids. I guess we'll just go the same way he did. Oh, we don't have the camera yet. Hmm. Well. I will say this game does a pretty decent job of sort of hinting where you're supposed to go. Small piece of paper. September 12th. Now there's another rope. And another rope. Uh-oh. I mean, it kind of sounds like in their case, you can have too much rope. So, we'll see. Okay, and don't worry, the protagonist can go more than one speed. I've just got to remember. No, this is as fast as she can go. So we will try to speed things up. Also, why would you come here at night? Is my question. Can we can we just ask the sensible questions? Why would you come here at night? Unless she tried during the day and didn't have the same effect or nothing was found? I don't know. Chat, can you answer that question? Why would you come here at night? I'm also curious what is on her uh, little crest. She's nocturnal. <laughs> oh. Miku. Okay. That's our protagonist's name. Did something happen to my brother? Hello. This is your mom's camera? Himuro Mansion investigation. Himuro Mansion was what the, once the home of a large landowner that controlled vast areas of land. They also say that the site held some significant, some special significance that had to do with Shinto rituals of the region. I couldn't find any detailed books about these Shinto, ritual, Shinto ri rituals, though. The last master of the Himuro la family line massacred his entire household. Later, another family that tried to live there disappeared. Because of incidents like these, nobody visits the mansion today, and it lies in ruins. Maybe that's why there aren't any accounts of the Shinto rituals, and why the exact location of the place isn't recorded anywhere. September 24th. I've had a bad feeling ever since I came to this mansion. I'm leaving notes in this notebook just in case anything happens to me. I've got to find Mr. Takamine and the others fast. I hope it's not too late. Uh... Sir? Are you okay? 
Uh, I'm the only one shown reflected in the mirror. Who could that woman be? Okay, I still can't go this way, so we're going this way. Oh, not that. Oh, sparkle. My mess checks the drawers. Medicine container. It's like between those two weeks that Mafuyu was here and Miku followed, someone went and scattered all these helpful items for us. Maybe, possibly, perhaps. Mafuyu! Brother Shadow. Alright. I will panic take pictures. For sure. Especially with like these little quick shots that you have to do. I'm gonna try my darndest. We will see. It's still padlocked. Maybe someone's in there? Oh. Do we want to go in there? Do we really want to go in there? Why are we looking here? Late night bullseye knifey! How are you? Yes, we're doing late night. You gotta do you gotta do at night for the spoopiness, am I right? Oh, we got more herbal medicine. Why is there a clock here though? Is my curiosity. Alright, so we got a map. That's that's the save point, I believe. There's that door. And that door that's locked, but we haven't seen a key for it yet. We got items. We got herbal medicine just in case. Mom left it when she died. Shows things unseen by the naked eye. Oh no. Doesn't have strong exorcism power. Woo! Dang. For a second I thought it was reverse, but no. Oh, oh, there was something down there. I saw a sparkle. Okay. Get. Don't you start with me. Spooped enough as it is. For a second, it sounded like chanting. I couldn't tell what that was. Oh, come here. Something behind the door? Ma'am, 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 ma'am. you do camera controls too find a mode you can see things that can't be seen with the naked eye try taking a photo in case in the if the controller vibrates or you hear strange noises well 
I'm not going to be relying on the vibration. So hopefully, hopefully uh, strange noises will work. Kind of like that. He's... In a folding screen in the photo, a door appears where the screen should be. Can we move the folding screen? <laughs> also, I do not know if the scare the streamer thing went off. Like, you guys are hearing the sounds, right? Like, I'm hearing them, even if the little uh, image that pops up with them doesn't appear on screen, I'm assuming. Oh, we're... It was back in this room. Wasn't it? Hang on. That's the hallway. seen that so what about that door? oh in here a hey, box of film I was gonna say, it's like, it should be movable, right? Just like in the photo. Hidden door behind the screen. Yep, nope. spirit. I don't know, you tell me. I was gonna say this panel looks more suspicious than all the others, but it might just be lighting. Um. I see a shiny. A little piece of paper on the chest. Looks like a news clipping. Late yesterday, a human body with no limbs was found in Himuro Mountain, located in the southern region of the prefecture. prefecture. The body's hands, feet, and head were all torn off. The police is investigating the case as both a murder and accident. The body has not been identified, but it is believed to be a man around the age of 30. The police is also taking into consideration that the, the fact that a body, mutilated in the same manner, was found in the same location 15 years ago. Again, this game is rated for team, but this is still like it is still going. It's still going to be something. 
for violence and such, so. Yeah. The woman in the kimono is coming. The little girl? Do y'all mind? Paper lampshade. It's a film. Type 37. Looks like a new roll of film. Okay. Scroll the picture. Faint and sad. What is that noise? Oh. <gasps> the heck? Pardon? Dang, it went fast enough. I'm probably gonna miss some of these. Yep. Hi. Uh, I got a camera. I'm not afraid to use it. Uh. Okay. September 9th, 5.40 p.m. The mansion was nowhere to be seen on the map, so we finally had to ask the locals how to find it. They told us that Himuro Mansion had been empty for several decades now. The same ones who told us where it was also warned us not to come here, which was quite disconcerting. You didn't listen? That's my question. Like, what made you not want to listen? Yes, this is our way forward. Those kimonos? Uh oh. Keep being too late, but if I was gonna take it back here, I would have taken a picture of the kimono. Dang it. Herbal medicine, good. Hmm. Small mirror stand, but the mirror is missing and the drawer is locked. Okay. Y'all mind? Oh boy, here we go. Excuse you?
Oh boy. There we go. <sighs> Almost let him get me. Cameraman and glow with mystical power. The seal. Our mystical power by damaging ghosts. Camera acts as a power up screen. Lock the seal with the camera with the accumulated mystical power and power up. Excuse me. Unlock auxiliary function seal. You enable many special attacks. To use the enable and auxiliary function, press the L1 button while in a shooting stance. <laughs> Hope I remember to use that one. The number of auxiliary functions you can use is limited to the number of spirit stones in your inventory, so be frugal. Okay. Well, there's that at least. Another white tape. Guess we gotta listen to it. September 9th, 9.40 p.m. It seemed dangerous to walk through the mountain at night, so we decided to spend the night here and continue our work. I've been through several rooms already. Unlike the exterior, the interior is still in quite good shape. A little earlier, I thought I saw a white, shadowy figure of a woman in the hallway near the entrance. I'll keep track of such sightings and publish them in a later account. So you stayed the night? What? It's one thing to go walking through this place. It's another to stay in a place like this. No, thank you. Like, my gosh. I mean, like, how long did it take you to, like, get up here? Is the question. Is this a door? It kind of looks like a door, but I guess it's not going to open for me. What I should I guess I should head back to the fireplace. One more. Hepping your step. let him get me. Yo, we got the zero shot. Let's go. <sighs> Just gotta breathe, chat. More medicine. Where am I? The worst thing you can do in a horror game is get lost. Right, because we came down that way, went in that room first. Okay. 
Something reflecting light inside the lion mask. Red hand mirror from the lion, lion mask. Okay. Oh, okay. So we need to go back and put the mirror in. Okay. I'm gonna try my best not to dilly dally shilly shally, but at the same time, I don't want to be running face first into a into a ghost, you know. They're so quick. I mean, this is PS2, ha! <laughs> Thank you, game. This was PS2, so I don't know if there's any kind of achievements, but I don't know if there's anything special that unlocks from getting all the the quick shots. And y'all can probably feel free to say something, like if it's a special perk or just a feeling of achievement or whatever. Through here? Y'all are trying so hard. Now you're getting scared just like I am, I guess. Are there faces in these kimonos? Unintentionally? That kind of looks like a face. Not gonna lie, kind of looks like a face. There it is. Hmm. It's that person I just saw. <gasps> oh. The ropes. That's concerning. See the faint shadows of ropes on the man's neck, arms, and legs. Oof. Hi. Uh oh. Back off. Dude. Okay, real quick. Let me. Let me snooze these ads. Caught them just in time. Where you at, dude? There you are. Wait. Dude, where are you coming from? Do you mind? Keeps changing it up on me. Ruth. Oh my word. This guy. Ha! This guy. The first of many tricky specters. Mm. Something shining where the ghost once stood. Cancels the camera's power. Ah, okay. Hold on. Okay, I'm I'm going to save the good film cuz spoilers, yes, I know that this is the better film. 
Um, I'm gonna save the good film, because, uh, we might need it. Okay, we can upgrade, we can do bonus functions. Okay, we can't do that. Pressure pushback slows down. More visible. Paralyzed search. Man, these are expensive. Shoot. Hmm. Alright. Okay, these aren't as bad. Hmm. Widens the capture circle. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, let me. Let's do that. I want to go back and find a save. Because what we found the key. We found the key, and hopefully, we're done with that guy. I kind of wonder if that's the guy that they found 15 years ago. Because he didn't look like any of the people that came with uh, the professor. Or whatever his face was. Oh, oops. Excuse you. I assume this is the key that we've got the padlock for, but first, I'm going back down that hallway to the save point. Real quick. And it is time for us to take a quick ad break as we do three minutes of ads per hour to turn off pre-rolls so that you guys get ad-free viewing for the most part. It also gives us a chance to stretch, uh, get a drink, get some snacks, maybe chill out for a minute. But, uh, we will be back after the ads roll. Yeah, I'm gonna go find the save point. Because heck, doing all this again. Oh. Also. I'm kinda low on health and I've got a bit of herbal medicine. Okay, does not heal halfway. Good to know. There's that save point. Saves us 30 minutes of time. Alright. We're safe here. Right? Right. Alright. Yeah. As we're starting, I'm gonna stand up and stretch. I suggest you guys too. And I will be right back.
Hey back, thank you for your patience for the ads. It's bedtime, be checking out the VOD. Have a good one, EK. Hope you have a good night. Oh. Well, that's unsettling. Did not know that appeared if you idled for long. Excuse me. Alright. Ha. Ha, game, you're spoopy. Alright. Yeah, let's continue. But uh, who. Oh. Pardon? Oh, hi. Do you mind? almost missed that guy. It was like, first I saw the blood handprints, and then I saw the red glow. The red glow means bad things. So, uh, yeah. I was gonna say, it's like, have those bloody handprints always been there? But then, who knows? Alright, let's keep going. Yeah, I think they added this after that one. Hmm. Right, upstairs. I'm suspicious of, like, everything now. Alright. I assume it's to this padlock. Yep. Lovely. Old book written in charcoal ink on the shelf underneath the urn. Secret rituals of the Himuro family. Many rituals and customs have been passed down through generations of the Himuro family. Most of them are lost. The only things we have left now are some documents that record these rituals as a legend. Hardly any of the oral history remains. This is all because all Himuro family, have family members are dead, and those who were close to the family have kept quiet about the ritual. One ritual in particular, performed on December 13th, is shrouded in mystery. People who lived near the mansion stayed inside on that particular day, and even now, it is considered bad luck to leave the windows open on that day. Oof. I can only assume that this is due to the cruel nature of the ritual, but the truth remains unknown. Oof. Yeah. An old brazier. So much dust inside you can't see the bottom. Marble medicine. Hmm. These doors? Oh, he goes outside. Okay. Oh. I saw a shadow. Well, medicine, I'll take it. <sighs> it's like this game shouldn't be making me scared, but it does like it does a really good job of feeling me filling me with dread. I will admit. 
Probably saw the shadow. What is that? Roll of film. Here, you can take those. We'll take the better film. Is that necessary? Oh, hi. Woman at Mirror. So it's she was the other woman that came with the professor. Excuse me. Red notebook scrap. August 27th. The more I found out about Humero Mansion, the creepier it gets. I'm sure it's the perfect subject matter for Mr. Takamine's next book, but to be perfectly honest, I don't like this assignment one bit. It gives me a bad feeling. There's no way I want to go to that mansion, but it's my job, right? I guess I'll have to go. And I wouldn't want to waste the chance to work with Mr. Takamine just because of a little uneasiness, either. It doesn't help I have the sixth sense for the supernatural, either. There's such a thing as knowing too much sometimes. Oh, uh, sometimes you gotta go with your gut, chick. Am I right? Sometimes you gotta trust your gut. Let's see, this is downstairs. We haven't fully explored the upstairs yet. Anything out here wanna spook me? I'll take more of that. Door stuck fast. Try pulling on it wouldn't budge. Okay. Down the stairs we go, I guess. Hide. Ready the camera. Something. Give back. I thought he was saying get back. Hold on. Have to die because of this one. This is why they give me extra. You're gonna be cheap. You rude.
Oh boy. Okay, so we came down the stairs. There's something you're looking at, child. Ooh. Those marks are a little unsettling. Krista, how are you? Welcome into the spoopy game. Kinda sounds like a pipe organ. Alright, let's go... Let's see what's in here. Wait a minute. That looks familiar. Or no? I thought that looked like that one hallway we went to. Oh, this is on the other side of this room. Okay. Gotcha. Guy head to bed. Have a good one, scared so. Thank you for hanging out. <laughs> also, I tried to make the sounds not as obnoxious um, for the scares. So, we'll see. Yeah, we'll be playing this a few nights a week. A few a few nights this week. So there'll be plenty of plenty of times for you guys to tune in. I appreciate you tuning in for the nostalgia. game I'm wasting film what do you mean hmm. old scroll among the fallen candles the strangling ritual oh goody on the 13th day of the 12th month, that Maiden cut off from the outside world for 3,669 long days shall be torn apart to provide power to the rope. Oh. That sounds lovely. that dang it a red notebook scrap September 11 6 30 a.m. I saw that woman in the white kimono again she's trying to tell me something she knows I have the special sense for ghostly things the woman's name is Kyrie so it's Kyrie huh I shouldn't get any closer than this I don't want to get any closer I'm scared Fair. I would be too, woman. Oh, hi. Another place shows in the photo. I wonder if there's something there. I don't think we've seen that yet. Hmm. Spirit stone. Looks for a mortuary tablet and bone remains among the candles. The owners? Well, that's lovely. Wait, is it like actual... Is that a hip bone? 
Hmm. Came in this way. Again, the worst thing you can do in a horror game is get lost, so... Save point. Pooch. And I'll take this. There. Oh, a couple things. Black notebook scrap. September 13th, 930 AM. We found Ogata's body. His head, hands, and feet were strangled off. What happened to him is just like the strange deaths that occurred here long ago. There was a photo of Ogata near him. In it, there was something that looked like ropes on his neck, arms, and legs. I wonder if it has anything to do with the rope shrine maidens and the legends around here. The girls that had ropes tied to their necks, arms, and legs, too. September 13th, 12, 10 PM. Tomoe is acting strangely. She's been mumbling nonsense all morning. Something about ropes and mirrors. I can't blame her for going to pieces, though, after seeing what happened to Ogata. So... This might be Takamine's notebook. Because I'm assuming Ogata was the, the dude in the one room that we found the photo and the key. And then I'm assuming Tomoe is the woman's name. So that might be Takamine's na Takamine's notebook. Old scroll on the ground. Five stones document. Give thanks to the five gods' protection. Place the stone representing the five mirrors in the correct location. Himuro family crest. It probably unlocks the door, but it's broken. Hmm. Okay, so we need some kind of stone to place there. We don't know what yet. Okay. So go back this way. Oh, okay, so I'm guessing that this is what we were seeing was the other, the door on the other side over here. More Type 37 film, I'll take it. If we start having more Type 37 than we do Type 45, it might be time for a switch. Maybe. Okay, that door is locked. That door up there is locked. Okay, so we can't go in that room if that's red. But we haven't been in this this room yet either. Okay, this door? This looks unsettling. Red notebook scrap. So, what the red notebook is, uh, Tomoe. The black notebook is, uh, Takamine. September 10th, 8 p.m. I clearly saw the image of a woman in front of the mirror near the entrance. She had long hair and a white kimono. There were ropes tied to her arms and legs, and she dragged them along when she walked. I think I heard Koji talk about something like that, too. There's something very wrong about this mansion. Yeah, you could say that. Man, 
that scraping though. Nothing here. Although I don't like that stain on the door that much. Huh? Oh, there's something. It is nailed shut, can't look outside. Type 14 film. Okay. Okay, I was afraid this was going to be some kind of endless hallway or something. Or something. Sacred water. What does sacred water do? Fully restores energy. Oh. So is, I guess this is like a full heal. Oh, wait, excuse me. Why did they give me that here, though? A little concerning. Research scrap. The Mystery of the Rope Maiden. Among the few documents found on the ritual, mention of the Rope Shrine Maiden is made many times. Her arms, legs, and neck are bound by five ropes. However, no documents discuss the role she plays in the ritual. One theory is that she is a sacrificial lamb, but I find it hard to believe that such a cruel ritual is practiced. You obviously didn't talk to the other guy that wrote about the rope shrine maidens, but whatever. Something is wrapped around the handle. It won't move. It looks like hair. Oh, gosh. Well, that's creepy. Uh oh. Ooh, they're in front of me. Hey! Run away! No, child! Why they had that hallway like that? How are we doing on help? Oh, man, excuse me, y'all. As we'll be closer to full than closer to not full. Okay, what do we have? Can't go that way. Oh. Oh, it goes back to the main, the first hallway. Okay. So that would have been a shortcut, which is unfortunate that you can't open that. So I'll have to go back around. All right. Wait, did I try? I don't know if I tried this door. Oh. Well, a piece of paper in the crevice. Old news article. On the night of the 3rd, the police received a report that four children failed to return home after 9 p.m. There is an old superstition in the surrounding villages about children being snatched away by ghosts, and some villagers indeed suspect that this is what happened to the four kids. 
Wave. That's something. Where's their door around here? Ah. There are buttons with characters. This device must open the door. There's an engraving underneath, but it's gouged. I can only read some of it. I can just barely make it out. The Shinto ritual, strangling and held on the day of from the gouged out words. Uh. I. I don't even know. All right, we don't know the answer to that, so we'll we'll make a note of this. Hmm. I had a thought. I thought maybe it might show something. All right. All right, so we've got a couple of locked doors. And for now, all we can do is just go back up the stairs. Let's circle around. Yet again, sounds like someone's playing that pipe organ. That closet. Oh, wait. Oh, we didn't go in this door. Okay. Why is there a save point in here? Why is there a save point in here, game? Obviously, I think I was supposed to find this one before the previous one. Audio tape in front of the doll. The red tape. Research one. Red notebook scrap. August 20th. It seems a folklorist named Ryozo Munakata was studying about the various rituals passed down at Himuro Mansion. He supposedly left a book of research, but I can't find it anywhere. I wonder if there's a copy in a library somewhere. August 30th. I still can't find the book. I'll have Koji Ogata from the editing department do a search for it. I doubt he'll be able to find it, though. Okay. There's something inside the drawer. Yo, more type 14. I'll take it. Small door here. It's nailed shut. I can't open it. Rats. Rio, what about the red tape? September 10th. 
10.20 a.m. We discovered some disturbing photos in a chest of drawers. Could these be the folklorist's children mentioned in Koji's notes? The photo is quite old and shows some kids playing tag. In the corner of the photo, there's a faint image of a young girl in a white kimono. Her finger is pointed this way, and her eyes look as if she's making some silent accusation. Hmm. All right. Anything else around here I should know about? Can't know. Where else am I heading? In there. It almost looks like we've been everywhere, but... Interesting. Jinsei Takamine, gathering info. Uh, hmm. Miyuki Hinasaki. Hmm. It's interesting that they have a little flowchart that says, like, the correlations to everybody, because that could get confusing. Oh, door and candle room. Shows a someplace with a row of chests. I saw that, but I don't think I've seen anything like that. Since that kind of looks like a ladder. Ugh. This is the balcony. Strange lady still out there? No. I don't even think we can get in that room. In there. Like, I don't want to get lost, but I honestly don't remember seeing those chests underneath, like, a, a stairwell or somewhere. Wait, unless... Unless they were back in the the other room, maybe. Dead. 
Shame I can't open this door. <laughs> I can't just leave, can I? Front door won't open as if something is holding it. Seems sealed by a powerful force. Oh. <laughs> well, guess we're not leaving. Hmm. I guess at the very least, while we're not making progress, we won't get jumped by ghosts. Hopefully, possibly, perhaps. The game, I think, is acting like we were supposed to have seen that picture we took, but I really don't remember seeing those chests of drawers. Oh, did we go over here? I don't think we did. Yeah, I honestly don't think we did. Just a closet? Ain't gonna do me that way, game. The heck? Oh. Uh, what do you mean, game? There it is. Oh, hi! Ah, rude! Nate. Yeah, get back. Hey. Well, so how are you, bye, dude? Okay. 
made a little bit of progress. Or at least we found another ghost. There's nothing in here now that they were trying to spook me of. Can't go that way. Meal shut, can't open it. Let me just check in here real quick. There. Hang on, there are these, but. Don't look the same. I drop in, say good luck in spooky game. Thank you. It's going. It hasn't been too bad so far. It's more than it's, it's, this game is kind of filling me with dread, as I'm sure it's doing for a number of you too. Just because of the atmosphere that it sets. But it's going. It's going so far. Oh, uh, you want to open the door? There we go. Old kimono chest. Wait, is that sign still here? I feel like this is a thing, but I can't do anything about it, I don't think. No, look at that again. I didn't read it. it said something about an old kimono hangs here, but... somebody here now. Oh! You are coming on fast. Go away. It's just a head! Go away, child. Maybe use my my items. in the wrong way.
Eat it. I don't understand. Was this... Was this a ghost I missed? Or is this just like an extra ghost? back near the hearth room. I don't understand. I don't know what this is or what I might need to do about it. Hmm. Okay, well I know the chest of drawers aren't here. I mean, there's these chest of drawers. Yeah, that's not it. Go back upstairs. <clears throat> Make sure now because I feel like I'm missing something. I saw something shine underneath it, unless it was the glare of her flashlight. None of those don't look right either. Is it this box? No. Yeah, I definitely feel like I'm missing something.
We'll go back in here. Go back this way. Check that closet. We need to go forward here. Red box is inside, but the door is broken. It won't open. So this is obviously progress. Sealed by the talisman. don't know what the we don't know what the pattern for that door is Okay, so we need to find we need to find those chests from that one picture. A storehouse. I don't think we've seen a storehouse though. nice if I could have like a little nudge or something. Also, this looks like we're coming up on ads. Um, I'm gonna see if I can wander around and find a little bit of progress. Because I understand what I should find, I just don't think I've seen that yet. I don't think we've been to a storehouse, nor have we found a way forward. The only other thing is this door right here that says something about when everything happened. Unless we were supposed to pay attention to the, uh, the what's it, the sc scraps of paper, which I have no idea 
what that is. It says numbers, but... Shinto ritual strangling and held on the day of. Okay, real quick. I'm going to see if I can use Google Translate to see if those are numbers. Because I get the feeling that's maybe what it is. We'll see. And while y'all go in a quick break... It's showing me the top one is, it says zero, the one to the left of it says one, and then the one to the right of it says ku, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Is it just zero to nine? I guess it would help if I could read Japanese, maybe. And if this is in regards to the strangling, the strangling ritual. 13th day of the 12th month for 369, 3,669 days. Oh, is it just 3669? Oh, I'm gonna try that real quick. If we make progress, which I should take a stand-up break as well soon. Zero. One, two, three. Three. Four. Five. Six. Eight. Or seven, eight, nine. Okay. Okay, then. One, two. Three? Nothing. Dang it! Okay, real quick, I need to take a quick stretch break so you guys can chill here and look at the door, I guess. No, let's, let's leave. Alright, give me just a minute, I'll be right back.
Alright. Thank you very for your patience. Alright, let me look. Let me see what this door says, because I think this is the only way forward for us. Shinto strangling held on the day of. And I also found out, for those of you that were in the ads, I did find out that these uh, characters mean the numbers 0, 1 to 9. I took out Google Translate because there's been nothing on here that indicates uh, what these letters say. So these are these are like 0, 1, 2, and so forth, all the way to 9. I tried a 3669, and then I've tried 1213, but I haven't tried. <coughs> I haven't tried 1312 since Japanese is Japanese dates are backwards so that could be it oh wait I'm entering zero I'm smart zero or one three one two Hey, okay. So it was the date backwards. 1312 instead of 1213. Ah, and this is what we're looking for. Hi. Powerful, fear, feel a powerful presence from the back of the room. Seductress. Ah. Uh. Okay. And then that likely had to be the door in the burial room. Okay, cool. Thank you, I was... Kinda sorta running low on that because of that one stupid woman's head ghost thing. Uh -huh, let me see if there's anything up here. I mean, this is a storeroom. Surely there would be something stored here. Spirit stone. Oh, I haven't been powering up my camera either, and I've got some points. Oops. Hmm. Time for mystical charge. Uh, sure. I suppose the mystical charge one is all those characters, the blue characters that appear, and maybe the orange characters on the zero shot. We'll see. Hey, at least we found progress, right? Right. Nothing in here. I've been finding all these spirit stones, but I haven't been able to use them yet. So various items. Okay. Well, let's get out of here and go back to the burial room. Yeah, I don't know how you were supposed to find out. Wait. Is that why they have that clock face there? Is that how you're supposed to find out what the letters mean? 
or what the characters mean. Because I was like, how are you supposed to figure out how to read Japanese to, uh, well, to uh, undo that lock? Mm. Okay, where's the burial room? Oh, just right back through there. Perfect. Oh. Somebody's Angie in here now. <laughs> ah! Back off! Lady? You rude? I need this lady to go away! <laughs> no! The devil! <laughs> Woman? Give it. <laughs> yeah, you don't like that, do ya? So I guess I shouldn't be trying to get smug with these ghosts. And she's like, it hurts. So she could have been like one of the sacrifices or something. I mean, she was coming for me. All right, no talisman. We can go through the door. Oh. That's blood. Why is there blood here? Something's over here. Uh oh. There's a baby ghost on the loose. Some other place shows in the photo. Is that a water wheel? Huh. Oh. Well, sadly, I was slow. Hmm. Well, the blood continues this way. Black nook, nook scrap. So this is Takamine. September 13th, 3 p.m. Tomoe's condition is getting worse and worse. She can't stop shaking and she keeps mumbling the same words over and over. I don't know what it's what I don't know if what's happening is anything supernatural or not, but in any case, I think we better leave as, leave as soon as possible. Tomoe is in such bad shape she can't even move. I guess I'll have to look for a way out of here myself. Even if we waited for help, I doubt anyone would ever come looking for us. Rip. Yeah, so that's that's that bad quiet way. Excuse me. Oh, we have another talisman. Doll room. Okay. Now we're outside. Wait, there was something on the stairs. Audio tape. Okay. September 11th. 
8.16 p.m. We looked all over the mansion, but we still couldn't find Koji. While true that this mansion is huge, I'm certain we would have found him by now. Could we have already left? He's been saying something about more ropes since we took some photos yesterday. Hmm. So Koji was the first guy that we found that supposedly got roped, unfortunately. And then I'm assuming that's Tomoe saying that recording. Oh, hi. Hmm. Okay, so she went that way. Can we go in whatever this is? Doors close fast. Looks the door, but it's broken. Okay. So, excuse me. I'm wondering if we'll get anything that will help us fix that in the future. Mm. Oh, that sounds like a water wheel. It's also very foggy out here. Ah. Uh. Whale. That was something. gonna be on this tape. September 12th, 9 a.m. I found Koji. His death was just like the one in the mountain village. His head and limbs were severed. I can't believe what's happening. Oof. Okay, so there's... There's the water wheel. Learn lantern in the photo was lit. Right. Okay, we need to. I need to take a photo of this, I'm assuming? No. Then what water wheel is it? Don't show. Oh, maybe another angle? A little bit garden lantern. Ah, here we go. Woman pulled in. Oh gosh. Great. That should be one seal. It says something about a lit garden later, but 
these are garden lanterns and they're lit, but nothing's happening. Oh, this looks... This looks assuring. Stone mirror. Kind of mystical cosmic powers are you talking about? points that I don't have. Mm. Oh, good. Okay, we don't have to go out there. I said, please don't let me go out in the, the creepy bridge in the middle of the water. That would be unsettling. Broken one seal. Yeah, now we're kind of back on track, at least. <laughs> Chat, are y'all spooked? Like, yeah, I'm getting a little used to it, but that doesn't mean the game's not going to throw something at us. In the future. Okay, that's the doll room. Other one is this way. Uh-oh. Hi. Well, there's the doll room. Hey, Lasson. Sorry, wrong song. <laughs> Kyrie is a name, but also an old hymn song I remember. Like from college. Hmm. Why are you looking over here, child? Hmm. September 12th, 1.45 p.m. My sixth sense is telling me some children are playing here. I can't see them, but they keep calling to me. Are they playing tag? Or hide and seek, maybe? They might be the children in that photo. 4.30 p.m. There were human heads in that room. So many of them. They were cut off by the Humiro family man's master. They were all trying to tell me something. Ooh. Again, I told you guys, there's going to be an amount of violence in this game. We might not see it, but still. I never should have come here. I should have trusted that sixth sense of mine. Yeah, you should! Always go with your gut. Like, never doubt yourself. I mean, sometimes you have to think through things, but sometimes you need to just follow your gut. Or, like, you know, trust that feeling you've got. Because sometimes it's telling you something. Okay, one of these is going to be the way to unlock the other door. Another spirit stone. Oh. Oh, child onlooker. Got it. Ooh, boy. Oh, hi. Nope, run. Look at my foot! 
Whoop, nope, nope, nope. I'm standing like right on her. That was a big shot. 2,300 points for that one shot. Take those. Okay. Creepy children ghosts. Okay. Oh. Any Japanese dolls on a red mat? Well, the other thing say, I keep mashing through text by accident. I need to stop that. Okay. But at the very least, we've also unlocked the seal outside. Roofed off with sacred ropes and worshipped. The weird thing is, is I can totally see a child trying to call crawl into a small hiding space like that. Like, absolutely. I would do it if I was when I was a child. I used to crawl I used to crawl into like the smallest kind of spaces to like hide for hide and seek. Especially like in the dryer. Thankfully my bro older brother never turned it on while I was inside. Bless him. That would have been horrible. Uh, oh, you again. Like ma'am. Ma'am. Another one of these. Now is the fact that she kind of fell from the roof for some spoop factor. Thank you, video game. Again, this game is gonna get me. Like, it's already kind of unsettling, but this game is gonna get me. More ways than one, probably. Oh. Hi, Takamine. Oh, jeez, I'm running a little film already. Hmm. All right. A lighter. There's a little bit of oil left inside. It has J. Takamine engraved on the back. Notebook. September 14th, 10 a.m. That woman that Tomoe called Kyrie looks just like the descriptions of the Shirope Shrine Maiden in the legends. And there's a strong resemblance, too, between the way Tomoe and Ogata died and the manner of the deaths in the folklore. So that woman is the Rope Shrine Maiden, is she? Hmm. Maybe the mirrors in this mansion mean something? Maybe. Maybe it's to see that rope, rope slowly coiling around your neck. Oh. Gotcha. I'm trying to be faster about these. Especially with me losing... Getting low on film. Oh, not that. Red notebook scrap. The mirror is breaking. Smash! A broken mirror. People on the floor all over the mansion. So many people. All those people. What are they running from? And then at the end, with such desperate looks on their faces. Something's coming this way. 
from deep within the mansion. A coldness. It's colder than anything I've ever felt. I don't know anymore if this is a dream or real. Lovely. or water house? Cool medicine I'll take. Dripping is a little unsettling. Oh. Why are we getting a cutscene? Get off the bridge, get off the bridge, get off the bridge. Oh no, don't tell me I'm gonna have to fight something. While limited, oh. Ooh, boy. Oh, no. Do we have to fight Tomoe now? I think this is Tomoe. There we go. Get out of here. I ain't playing around with you anymore. Red tape four. Oh. Since we met that girl, I've seen many strange visions. All the ghosts in the mansion howl and scream at me. I don't think they'll ever let me out of this mansion. I don't even know how long I can hold on to my sanity. Anyway, I'm leaving this tape. If ever someone listens to this, please tell me what has happened to me. Still, I hope it's just a dream. Mm. Okay. Oops, something over there. A little girl in a white kimono keeps pleading to me. I can't keep my mind focused, but her voice rings in my head and won't leave. 
But what does she want me to do for her? I can't even get out of this mansion anymore. Broken. Five pieces. The mirror. Tell Mr. Takamine the way to break the curse. So, a mirror? Oh, another one of these. I can just barely make it out. The Chosen Maiden Purifies. Have we seen something like that? Hang on. Purifies. We could try three three six six nine. Oh, June say Takamine, that's his name. Yeah, and the only thing I could think of entering here is 3669. Chosen Maiden purifies. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hey! The red letters mean something. <laughs> Okay, there's a save over there. Good. Just let me be able to go use it, game. Don't be mean. Because I think this is where this one ghost is that, like, got me way back when. Was. Yup, it's the well. Just let me get over here. Maybe grab this. Alright. Thank goodness. We saved! And even though I probably wasted more medicine than I really wanted to, at least we got to save him. Double check. Good deal. Okay, we've got type 37. Yeah, we might need to start using the, the type 37 film. Okay. Anything else? I can afford stuff, but I just don't know what... What is it? I don't know... I guess once I have the auxiliary... Auxiliary functions unlocked, it lets me use them. Other than that, I don't know. Ooh, excuse me. Okay. 
We're okay on health as long as we're smart. And we're using the more powerful film. So let's just pray we can do this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the this is the ghost. Man, making me use my good film. Rude. I saw that move. I'm not dumb. Well, inside, I can't see. Why do they have the sparkle on there, though? That's so eerie. Hmm. Obviously, I'm supposed to do something with that. Oh, there's a walkway. Okay. Oh, hi. No, it's all. I think this was the ghost lady that got me so much long ago. Is this so telling? I am not messing around with you, lady. Oh, she like jars my senses. That's creepy. Oh, cheap. That was the moonstone. Okay, so the moonstone is an instant revive. That kind of stinks. They're now cheap as goofs. Man, this woman hurts. She really hurts. You know what? No. Get out of here. 
I mean, it stinks. I kind of had to use more film on her. Buh. Something over here. Ah. Okay. Yeah, that woman I think was the one that got me so much when I first played this game. She was a pain in the butt. Let us continue. Piece of a notebook in a plastic bag. September 14th, 8 p.m. In the materials Tomoe gathered for me, there's a photograph, there's a paragraph about five pieces of mirror passed down through the Humuro family generations. For generations. These pieces were said to seal off the Hellgate and protect the region from a great disaster. They might have something to do with the current hellish situation. Five holy mirrors and shrines around the area all broke in a small earthquake the other day. When I heard about it, it gave me the idea for this next work of mine. I think I brought a news article about it with me when I came here. It says there were only five holy mirrors in existence. But according to some legends, there is another, the true holy mirror. The folklorist also mentions this in his research documents, the ones I found here in the mansion. Excuse me. I think I dropped the research documents somewhere when I was trying to escape that cursed woman. Here are my theories. I think that the five mirrors that were destroyed in the earthquake the other day had the role of watching over the true holy mirror. I don't think it was the earthquake that broke the five holy mirrors in the shrines. I think it was the signal that the seal on the hell gate that the Humuro true holy mirror provides, 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 <laughs> has broken for some reasons. The five mirrors were trying to warn us. Hmm. Okay. Oh, don't you throw another dumb ghost at me, game. Monkey? Kookaburro? Oh, hi. Oh, so was he trying to fix the mirrors so he could repair whatever was going on? Is that it? Maybe. Oh, those are the lanterns in that backyard, aren't they? Oh, thank you. After I accidentally, accidentally used up that last one on freaking Tomoe's vengeful ghost. Kind of need that. Oh, hey, this one isn't broken. Probably unlocks, but it won't work. Five stones in the full ho four holes. Maybe I need one more. Okay. Oh, thank you. More Type 37 film. Huzzah. Okay, 
Okay, so now we can go back to the those lanterns. I just gotta figure out how to get back there. Let me look at the map. Went there. Fish tank room. Okay, it's actually not that far, because when it's through that room, down here, back in here, and then out that way to this. The abyss. <laughs> That's comforting. The abyss. <laughs> That's a comforting name for an area. It's not just pond, it's abyss. Totally makes me want to go there, video game. There's still something sitting there on the well, and I don't know if it's like I'm supposed to be able to remove the lid at some point. Oh, there it is. Audio tape. Okay, so we got a blue audio tape now. Well, we're assuming white was Takamine, red was Tomoe. Unless this is Ogata, I'm going to suspect this is Mafuyu. September 12th, 3.20 p.m. I know this sounds crazy, but there's something here besides us in this mansion. I've seen it myself. It was a woman in a white kimono. Something is definitely happening here. Have we unknowingly awakened something? Or perhaps we've been lured here to die? Hmm. Okay. I I can only assume that's uh Ogata. Or the other way around. That could be that could be Takamine or that could be Ogata. We gotta have an idea of who these people are as we're going. Okay, real quick. If anything else happens, I'm going to save in a different save file. Cause that Tomoe fight was hot garbage. So if between now and tomorrow night, if I can get a better Tomoe fight, then uh, I'm going to redo that. We'll go a little bit further for now, though. We'll go back to those lanterns. And we'll see what's there. I do hope everybody is not too spooked, and I hope you guys are enjoying the Fatal Frames, now that we're kind of sort of getting some idea of a story. Of like a kind of urban legend and the curseness behind it. Which this is kind of what Fatal Frame is. Fatal Frame goes off of like myths, Japanese myths and legends and folklore. And usually if there's a ritual and something goes wrong, bad things happen. Hence why Fatal Frames exist. Because I do know that, like, myths and folklore and stuff do have a pretty significant standing in ja uh, in uh, Japan. Like, all kinds of, like, ghosts and, like, oni or things like that. I kind of wonder, like, they keep showing these mirrors, so I'm wondering if these are... These are the, uh, the mirror mirrors. I also realize we never went upstairs. That's something else we didn't do. Yeah, we never went upstairs, but I need to go back to the lanterns. So we'll go do that before we go upstairs.
Isn't it over here? Oh, more Type 37. I'll take it. Missed that the first time we came through. Isn't this showing the four lanterns? Now we can walk around. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I just got it. Yeah, we've got the guy's lighter. So we can we can we can do something with the lanterns. Okay, that's lit. That one's lit. Yes. I can go in the door. Cool. Thank you, video game. Alright, real quick. Real quick before these ads go off, I think I'm going to make my way back to the save point. Because we have been making decent progress, I feel. We have been making decent progress. But it's also getting late. We've been going about three hours or so. But I didn't want these to be incredibly late, at least not for the first couple of nights. Oh, hi. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we're dealing with another ghosty. Hi. Ah! Do you mind? Get back. Oh, so that's how she tells you she's hurting, is you just have her heavy breathing. Also miss this. Okay. Yeah, let's... Let's get back to that save point, which leads to the door, I think. We still haven't gone upstairs, but the stairs doesn't seem significant right now. And yeah, we'll need it to go in there. So, this is perfect. So, I am going to use my snoozes, but we are going to get back to that save point before we tackle that door puzzle tonight. But, uh, this has been fun. I am a little sad that we got a little lost along the way. Just not knowing what the game was expecting of me from being able to solve that door puzzle and knowing Japanese and all that noise. But, uh... 
Yeah, I am determined to beat this this week. Again, on Halloween, we'll probably start a little bit earlier, just because I'm not streaming that afternoon, since I'm typically off on Thursdays and whatnot. But, uh, yeah. But, game's got me a little bit here and there. It definitely hasn't gotten me to scream yet, or to, like, get really jumped, or whatever. Chad has tried, which I do appreciate, and I might tweak the, the sound alerts a little bit. Be it with uh, costs and timing and stuff. Just so you guys get to have a little bit more fun. But uh, this has been good. And I'm kind of glad I'm conquering my youth fears of uh, playing this game. Mm -hmm. Alright. Oh, we still have to listen to her breathing while she's saving. Poor girl. Right. This should totally be easy to make our way back to and hopefully with more items this time instead of getting our butt handed to us with Tomoe. All right. Yeah. Uh you you take a breather. You take a breather, Miku. But uh thank you everybody so much for watching. What do you like to chat? And I appreciate all you guys for hanging out and enjoying the fatal frames. We will be back with more of this tomorrow night. Um again I try to start I'm gonna start these between like seven and eight PM. I'll let you guys know on the Twitter on the discords, all that noise. And this has been a lot of fun. Uh, we will be back, of course, in the afternoon with uh, the regular stuff and whatnot. Let me see. Ooh, I know who I'm going to send you to. I have not been able to raid him in a while. But if you enjoyed yourself, I encourage you to follow so you know what we are doing and when. I know I'm not typically live at night and such, but I'm experimenting with stuff. Um experimenting with uh just different times and streams and i just especially wanted like the real spooky vibe because of halloween and everything else this week but um everything else if you want to join the discord so you know when i'm going live um if you want to check out the youtube where all of our playthroughs and all of my previously scary game playthroughs are as well if you enjoy me playing scary games and being scared and such um those are all on the youtube for you guys and other free ways for you to support the channel as we continue to grow and such but uh, we are going to go say hello to supreme if i can spell um there's your raid message he is playing eternal darkness uh, Sanity's Requiem, another interesting, spoopy, uh, cult classic, uh, supposedly. I have not heard of it, but he's been having a ball with it. But uh, we're going to go say hi to Supreme. He is another wonderful, welcoming, friendly streamer and all-around cool, cool guy and Twitch dad and IRL dad. But, uh, there's our message. We raid, we sit, the stream's a hit. You can always input your own emote if you don't have a Bullseye 2 one sit. But, uh, yeah. Let's snooze one more time. But, yep. Again, uh, tomorrow is more Stardew in the afternoon, at night, more Fatal Frames. I hope you guys are looking forward to that. But for now, I hope you all will have a lovely day or evening wherever you are in the world. And I hope I'll see you all again soon. Oh, let me do the raid message. Because I'm dumb. Yeah, there. <laughs> I'm getting ahead of myself. But yeah, come along and let us go see Supreme and do a raid. And then I'll see you guys next time. Take care, everyone.